Happy Halloween! <laughs> Hi, I'm the Disgusting Beauty. Welcome to my channel. I now have a Teespring store and I have some products up, so please support me on Teespring. Uh, I should have an announcement video, but I'm probably not make an announcement video. I'm going to just promote it uh, on every painting that I do. But here I'm going to try to make another product. Uh, I'm painting a mask. It's a simple mask I bought. It has a little design on it. I kind of like the design, but I, I, I think it's boring. It's, you know, it's just black. Uh, let's put some color on it. So I start by putting gesso on the mask. It probably wasn't the best idea. It's not wearable. This is a prototype that I'm going to release on Teespring. The materials were deteriorating as I was uh, putting it on, so it probably wasn't the best idea. Happy Halloween. There's been a time between the last time you saw me and what I've become. Alright, so anyway, I just did all this without being on camera. Let's paint. Yeah, it was Halloween. Uh, I didn't start it around Halloween. It was... I started it and then I took a long break for a while and I got back to it. So anyway, I'm starting off just putting out ultramarine blue and I think phthalo blue and now I'm just putting magenta and I'm using uh, the uh, trans flag colors I'm just using uh, blue and magenta I don't use white I use more yellows just to make the teeth look like teeth this is uh, one of my fastest paintings I've done in a while and I think because it was so fast between just shooting this and editing, I want to make more videos like this. I didn't even bellyache over, like, keeping everything that I did in. I skipped around a lot in the edits. I didn't keep every single brush mark I made. So I'm just putting in uh, different layers of, like, greens and yellows and grays on the teeth and yeah so I have a new Teespring store uh, I mean I talked about it a while ago but I figured I, I should make some more products so I decided to take a mask that I already had it had like a design with teeth and stuff but I thought it was kind of boring so um, I wanted to put some color on it and right here, I'm, I was going to flesh this out a lot more. I was going to put in gums. But then I just got these cool effects that I thought, like, oh, I don't want to really push any further. I just thought it looked cool. So I get to a point where I'm just painting this, and I decide, you know what, I like this, I'm done. And that's a good lesson to learn because... Uh, especially for me, but I know I'm not the only one who goes through this. Um, we obsess as artists. We obsess over our own work. And it's good when you're pushing yourself, but it does get to a point where th that obsession, that push, is starting to stall everything else that you want to do. And it's better to try to do it right the first time and mostly be happy with it and if you're not completely happy learn to accept like what it is and move on so we're about finishing up here putting some final touches and light layers on the teeth but yeah this i definitely learned i just need to uh appreciate my own work and get through it. And I think we are finished. Um, I don't know what else to do with it. I think it looks cool. So we're finished. Tape reveal time. 
This time I'm not going to have the tape ripping off the, the paper. disgusting beauty don't forget to click like comment subscribe also hopefully by the time this is up there will be a teespring mask might not look like exactly like this i can't really promise what teespring's gonna do but this hopefully will be a product all right i'm the disgusting beauty okay i'm gonna see you next time on the next video and it should be exciting Got another video up. I'm still going to be uploading the Underhaven uh, project, you know, since I already planned for the time releases. But since then, I've started a new uh, painting, and I'm already finished. It's one of those kinds of paintings that you just finish right away. All right, I'm the Disgusting Beauty. Like, comment, subscribe.